from Little Havana, just west of downtown. So striding forward now, Lou Brock. And we are ready for some for daytime Expo, baseball. The left fielder. Ready with the first Lou pitch. Here it comes. Brock. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. But this is first foul pitch, for the first block. strike. And it's one and one to Brock. Our game time temperature here to start play a balmy 86 degrees at first pitch. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Walker is under it. He's got it one away. Now with the plate, Ozzy Smith will swing it from the Good left side ball. right here. Yeah, he's not quite as powerful from the left side. He's certainly not Chipper Jones, who had pop from both sides of the plate. Much more pop hitting right handed. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. Line toward center field. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Now at the plate, Stan Musial. That is third. The center fielder, number six, Stan Musial. Before the first pitch, a check at first. And he'll get back in safely. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. And now they'll tag him out between first and second. So stepping in, number 47. It'll lead things off here in the bottom Lydia, half of the first. Marlin, the right fielder. Lays and off 1-0. and That misses 2 and 0. The 2 0 on the way. Easy fly ball into shallow center field. Oh, what happened? He can't make the play. Runner at first following the error. And now it'll be the catcher, Jorge Alfaro. Strike one to start the at bat. Swing and a miss, and he's in the hole 0 2 now. And here's a slider strike three called, and that'll be the first out of the that inning. The first baseman. And he gets ahead 0-1. Swing Garrett. and a miss, and he's quickly in the hole 0-2. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. That's a tough pitch oh, to throw a... right there, that front door curveball. Just missed hitting that inside corner. That's a very difficult pitch. I'm not sure if he wanted to get that one down and away, and unfortunately, that one stayed inside. And that's the dead center for strike one. Number one. Lifted in the air out to right. Slaughter has a read on it. Two gone. Up next for Miami, Brian that Anderson, it. as he'll the get his first man. opportunity oh, in this Brian. one. First pitch here misses Andrew's wide, play. one and all. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. He's set the 2 2. Trying to nibble here and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. Into the box, Albert Pujols. He'll start things out here in a tie ball game. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Popped up. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Settling in now, in a slaughter. He'll get to take his first cuts here. First delivery to him on the way. Here's a fly ball, well hit. He leaps, but he can't get it. It's down for extra bases. And he's in there easily at second with a one-out double. Coming to the plate now, Jason Kendall. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Owen won the count. Slaughter leads off second with one gun in the inning. Here it comes on nothing and two. Now a swing and the barrel of the bat breaks in two that time. And the off-balance throw gets him. Nice play for the out. 
Sliding into the box. Paul DeYoung trying to cash in here in his first at bat with a runner at third and two gone. Base hit into right center. The run is in to score and they take an early 1-0 lead. Now in the box, Matt Carpenter. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. Carpenter. Here's the first pitch to him. Now a first pitch changeup here. Too far inside, it's 1-0. and Runners off for second. Fouled away. A runner on first with two away. Hit back up the middle. And this will be out of reach for Castro. It's a base hit. So here now is the pitcher, Got it, Gibson. Yeah. Two's all the over the place. Two on, two out, and of course, here in inning number two. Liner towards second, but right there is the second baseman, and that will retire the side. Ready now for the Marlins. Neil Walker. He's set We're to lead Marlins. off the home half of Don't the second. Neil. Liner toward Walker. right center. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Now at the plate, Starlin Castro. Right in there for strike one, 0 oh and 1. Slider taken here, one ball, one strike. And he pumps the fastball by him here, 1 and 2 now. The 1 2 is in there, a called strike three. Ready now, Curtis Granderson. And he'll look at a fastball that doesn't miss by a whole lot. It's 1 and 0. Rounded to the right. Oh, but they throw it away at second. Luckily for them, the left fielder retrieves this ball quickly. So striding in, Sandy Alcantara, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Throw not in time at first, so the pitcher tries to give himself up, but instead he gets himself a base hit. And a called strike down in the zone, nothing in one. One and one to the Marlins leadoff hitter. Now, ball in two strikes now. I never found myself on the mound in the big leagues, but it must be nice to be able to go to that good hard fastball oh, when you're in a jam. Got him to go down the swinging catcher. there. Number 47 Jorge. becomes out oh, number Paulo. two this inning. Here's the 1-0. And now here's the ball hit pretty well out to the right center field. Usual has a beat on it. He's got it, and that'll get him out of the jam. Steps the all-time Cardinal great Lou Brock. Here's the first pitch to him. Early swing there as he pulls it foul to the right side. Here's a hard hit ball that'll be caught out there at short. Definitely well hit, but the leadoff man's retired to start the third. The batter, number one. Riding in once again, Ozzie Smith, a base hit in his first trip. First pitch on its way. Hit out towards second. Throw gets him, two down. Digging in for his second at bat, Stan Musial. Both for one for him here in this one. Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. High fly ball out to deep right field. But that'll be off the right field wall. The throw into second. But he'll be in there with a double. So here's the cleanup hitter, Albert Pujols. And now following the two-out double, he's got a chance to drive in a run here. First pitch coming. Here it is. Got him to go up the ladder there for strike one. This is the stuff that infuriates a manager. You have to think the game. You got to know he's trying to pitch around you. You cannot swing at that pitch out of the zone. Grounded back up the middle. And nothing will come with a two out double as the inning is over. 
Stepping into the box, Garrett Cooper he drew a base on balls his first time up. And here's a ball in the air now carrying a bit out toward right center. And that's into the gap and should be extra bases. So here's the cleanup hitter one. for Miami. Number one. 0 for 1 here in the early going. No balls and a strike to count. Just a bit late and he's fallen behind 0 and 2. Cooper leads off second with nobody out. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. To two balls and two strikes now. And this is swung on and missed. Five quick strikeouts now and that's your first out of the inning. There's a fastball right down Broadway taken for a strike. And one and one as this one's in on the hands. One ball and two strikes to count. Back to back breaking balls. He just missed that one right there, fouling it away. Do not expect a third. To his right, Pujols. And the throw is not going to be in time as he's able to reach base safely. Here's the first pitch to him. Well behind that fastball. It's a swinging straight. And he is cruising now. It's 0 and 2. Down and away, it's a ball and two strikes. Now a fastball, but that's easy to lay off, and it's back to even at two and two. And a swing and a miss, and another punch out here. Six already, and that's out number two. Runners on first and third, two away. Fastball was too much for him there, swung right through it. Little hesitation right there by the batter. It was great execution by the pitcher. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will... Trying to pick things up where we left off. Ina Slaughter. He'll try to get it going here to begin the fourth. First pitch on its way. Line towards center field. Granderson is there and he has it for the first out. So the base is empty here with one away. And stepping in is the catcher, Jason Kendall. Up the middle and in for a base hit. So that brings in the power now hitting middle infielder Paul DeYoung. Paul DeYoung. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Drill down the line. But a foul ball here, 0 and 1. On its way, the 0 1 pitch. Takes this the other way to right. But the catch is made on the line out there. Will they have a shot at doubling them off first? Striding in, Matt Carpenter. One for one after a single his first time up. He's set. Here it comes. Grounded foul off to the right side. Carpenter is a guy that thrives in these opposite handed matchups. He's often considered one of the absolute best hitters in the game against right handed pitching. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away. And that. It is Curtis Granderson. He'll lead things off here in this Leading one up, run contest. The center fielder, Curtis. Into the windup. Here comes Granderson. the 0 and 1. Well out in front of the breaking ball there for a strike. And he struck him out. Strikeout number eight now in the ballgame for him. The pitcher, number 22. Swung on and hit on the ground at the Wizard. Throw to first again. Already two away here in the home court. Back to the top of the Miami lineup now and stepping in number 47. 0 for 2 here to start the afternoon. And that misses for ball one. A ball and a strike. And a curveball here. Good pitch, but a better take. And it's to two and one now. He's fallen behind now. Three and one. This is good patience here to work at the three and one, especially after two quick outs to start the inning. Even if you don't end up getting a hit or draw. And we'll have to leave it there. Digging in now, Bob Gibson. He's in to get things going here in inning number five. Bob, first offering on its way. Hit the other way out toward right field. Under it is the right fielder. One down. 
So the lineup flips now over and digging in Lou Brock. He has flied and lined out in two trips in this one. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Out of here into the visitors bullpen. Ready once again. Ozzie Smith. He's one for two in this one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And here's a curveball that just about got away as it misses inside for a ball. That's a good pitch right there. But you know as a base stealer when you're in the box like that you want to protect your money makers right. You don't want anything around your knees or your feet. So he was fortunate to get out of the way of that one. Number 47 is there and he'll bring this one in. Now that Digging in once again. Stan Musial there. one for two with a double on his line thus far. Pulled toward right center field. Long run for the right fielder. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the. So coming to the plate, Jorge Alfaro. It Where was a flyout for him in his the last country. trip. Jorge. In on the hands a bit with the Alvaro. fastball. It's one and zero. Oh. And it's a called strike to even the count at one. Pretty adamant about working him inside right now. Back to back fastballs, and that one was able to find the zone. A swing and a shot hit down the corner, but it bends just foul into the second deck. This is in the air out to straightaway center. And he will run this one down, moving to his right, and that's the first out of the inning. Now Digging in and looking for more, Garrett thing. Cooper will yeah. try to follow up the double Cooper. in his last at bat with another big hit right here. And that's into the outfield for a one out base hit. Now to the plate, number one. He's 0 for 2 number with a strikeout one. in this one. First pitch coming, here it is. Squared that one up just a little late. Here right. And here's a swing and a miss as he falls behind Aren't nothing you? and two. Now on 0 and 2, I don't think we're going to see any more hittable fastballs. If we see one at now all, batting. it'll probably be Third extended out of the zone, Brian. or at least that'll be the intent. And so it was a swinging strike three, three. Number one becomes out number two this inning. I got two one no go. offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. And they're working the outer half here, but that one's wide for ball three, and it's fouled away. Is swung on and driven out to right center field. A ball that's well hit. And that one is gone on a two strike count with two away in the inning. First pitch of the at bat. Ground ball foul down the left side. A one pitch on its way. Off the plate and in. It's a ball and a strike. Walker lays off there. It's two balls and a strike. To two and two now. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Brock waits on it. And the inning is over. Digging in. Albert Pujols. He'll step in trying to do something about this 2-2 two -two tie. The first baseman, Albert Pujols. Slapped hard the opposite way. Number 47 is there and he has it for the out. As the plate in a slaughter, a hit in two tries for him so far. First pitch on its way. Now a ball grounded foul over toward the coaching box. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Granderson's after it, but he won't have a play. This is down and into the gap. Around second now and headed for third. The relay throw, but he is in there with a triple. So a runner stands at third. One man is out, and the dependable Jason Kendall stands in. Here's the first pitch to him. Now a swing, and he pops him up. This is right out in front of the mound. Alcantara with a little do-it-yourself play, and there are two down. Now that so a runner at third, two men are out, Paul and that'll bring in the Illinois DeYoung. State product, Paul DeYoung. 
Hoping to keep it tied. Here it comes. Fastball too high to start him out here. One and oh. Drilled on the ground is short. Throw in time and the side is retired. Here's Starlin Castro. He'll get things started here in the second half of the sixth. First pitch fastball Starlin. off the plate there, and it's ball one. And they won't get him to chase the curveball in the dirt that time, and it's 2-0 and oh now. And he'll lay the fastball in here to get the count back to 2-1. and one. Count is even at 2-2 two two to Starlin Castro. Here's one that misses inside, and the count's run full now, 3-2. and two. What a great battle to start this inning. What a great job by the leadoff hitter. He knows that this pitcher's starting to get up there in pitches. The manager's starting to get restless. Let's see if we... The battle for center fielder, Curtis. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Smoke toward the hole. A dive, and he knocks it down. And there is some stick to it of this as they still manage to get the out at first. What a play. Miguel Rojas will get a chance with a runner in scoring position here as he'll pinch hit now with one away. One and one. One and one. Slow roller out to short. And the off balance throw beats him at first, and that's a tough play. Now a check swing, but it's strike one anyway, says the home plate umpire. Ball one, and with just five and two-thirds innings under his belt, he's about to hit the century mark in his pitch count now. Yeah, Matty V in the weight. And the throw is in time to get him to retire the side. Marlene Garcia is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Here's Matt Carpenter. A hit in two tries so far. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And a close play at first, but a great stretch that time as they get him by a step for out number one. Next to hit will be the pitcher, Bob Gibson. He's lined out and flied out in two plate appearances. Gibson. Towards second. And this is taken for the out. Stepping in, Lou Brock. He's working on a one for three thus far. First pitch on its way. Lifted the other way out to left center. Granderson on the move. He gets there to make the catch, Ladies and that and ends the, the inning. For the traditional. Ready for another chance? Jorge Alfaro. He flew out in his last at bat. The catcher, Jorge Alfaro. The 0 and 1 delivery. Swing and a liner. Foul. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. And it's 1 and 2. Wow, that's a tough pitch to take. 0 2 fastball just off the corner. And I mean, just off the corner. Got him to go down swinging there. Jorge Alfaro is retired for the first out in the bottom half of the seventh inning. Garrett Cooper is at the plate now, and he's quickly behind 0 1. 1 and 1. Now the count of the Marlins' first baseman. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. Hit hard on the ground to second. DeYoung gathers it in. On to first, and there were two down. Stepping in and ready for another number shot. One. Number one. 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this number point in the ball game. Ball one to start the at bat. Fastball swung on and missed. And the pitch misses low and away for ball two. Line hard toward right center. And he will get there to make the running play, and that into the box now. Now, 
Ozzy Smith. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Here comes the first pitch. A bouncer up the middle. Played on the backhand. Throw is not in time. And a great job of lagging that out as now the go-ahead run is on base to lead off the inning. Stepping into the box, Stan Musial. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. And a pitch out, nothing doing though, and that's ball one. One-0 pitch. Line towards center field. And that's in there, base hit. Throw will hold him at second, but the go-ahead runs in scoring position now with still nobody out. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Albert Pujols. He lined out in his last trip, so looking for better fortunes here. Popped him up. A lean into the dugout, and he's got it. Oh, what a play, and a huge first down. Stepping up now, Ina Slaughter. The bats here with a double and a triple on his line in this one. Lifted in the air out to left. Walker moves over. He's got it, and there are two down now. At the plate, Jason Kendall in a big at bat in this one. Two on, two away here in the eighth. First pitch on its way. Line drive to center field. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Ready to take his hacks again. Brian Anderson. As he'll look to follow up the two run homer he launched over the wall last time up. One and oh, the count. That command may be starting to drift a bit. It's two and oh now. Three and oh now. Time to focus here. This game is way too close to be walking, guys, so we'll see if he can make him swing the bat off. Alex Colomay takes the ball here as he'll enter with a runner at first and nobody out. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0-1. He's going to need to shorten up and get that foot down a little bit earlier if he hopes to be. Oh, and he took a big swing at that one as this is driven out to deep left center field. Usual. It's on the warning track as he hauls it in for a loud out number one. Stepping up to the plate, Starlin no, Castro. Over two from him so far in this one. No balls in one strike. In the dirt here. And it's not in time as he's in well ahead of the throw. And a very big mistake as that'll move the possible go-ahead run into scoring position. On the ground near home, Kendall is up with it. And there's out number two. Now batting, Curtis now Granderson. Batting. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Strike one to start the at-bat. A pause. And the 0-2. Swing there as they tie him up inside for the third strike. And the Your Jose Arena please. will be on the mound to start please the ninth inning. Is for Miami. Now pitching and batting in the eighth spot. Number 62, Jose Ureña. Now playing center field and batting nine. Number nine. Here's the first pitch to him. Hit sharply toward the right side. Number 47 is there, and he makes the catch for the out. Digging in, Matt Carpenter. He's working on a one for three thus far. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Swing, and he pops him up. And that'll get down for a base hit. Joey Votto will be called upon this here to hit. hit with the game Joey on the line. Votto.
Oh, and one the count. Go ahead, runs in scoring position here with one away. Now the 0-2 pitch. And another foul ball. And he misses there, one and two. To two balls and two strikes now. Swing and a looper to left. And that's going to fall for a base hit. And the go-ahead runs in to score as they break the tie. It's three to two. Now back to the top of the lineup. Stepping in, Lou Brock. One in, one out, and one on here in the inning. Line towards center field. But sadly for him, this will head straight to the center fielder as he puts it away without much. Set and the pitch. This is in the air to left. Walker is there, and that retires the side. Number 48 will pinch hit here, and he's the potential tying run. Number 48. Jake McGee is the man called on to close this one and earn a save in the ninth. Pulled high in the air out to left field. And the move to the pinch hitter will not pan out as that's taken in for the first out. Now, now batter. Number 47. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Oh, that's out. Fastball just misses. That's ball one. Now a fastball for a called strike. It's one and one. Here, right. One one pitch is a slider that's cut on and missed for strike two. Struck him out. Struck him out again, I should say. His third Up punch out of the hard. game. The Below the knees, one, one ball, no strikes. And he looks at a slider in there, one and one. Oh, he thanks his lucky stars right there, getting away with that hanger. I cannot believe he didn't pull the trigger on that pitch. Tough curveball that time, but he's able to make a little contact to keep this at bat going. Miami down to their last strike. Count even at two and two to the Marlins catcher. Don't be surprised if he gets another back foot slider right here. Don't think for a second just because he took the first one that this pitcher won't come. Swing and a miss. He struck him out and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Fans are final line score. First for the victorious.